Here we have the oil supply curve in red and the oil demand curve in blue. The crossing point's the equilibrium level, or the price level. And these two, supply and demand, have been increasing over the past 20 years at about the same rate. But recently, the supply curve has not increased. It's not moved to the right anymore. While the demand has continued to increase, which has led to a increase in the prices. After we get past peak oil, we'll probably have a decline in the supply, which will mean the supply curve moves to the left, which again will raise the price level. Demand will be destroyed. Demand will move to the left more quickly than the supply is decreasing, and that will lead to a decrease in the overall price level. But eventually, the supply will move faster to the left than the demand is moving to the left, or the demand might move back to the right, and we'll have the equilibrium price go up again, and the cycle will continue. Each time the price level goes high, we'll have a recession, loss of jobs, and each time it goes low, people will think that everything is okay.